hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you using angular JS how to create color picker menu into drop down select option element right now this drop down control is empty I am reloading the browser see here we got the colors are binded into this drop down control using angular JS if you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I am using Notepad++. Now in this new one page, I am adding a simple HTML code. HTML. I am closing the HTML tag. After that, I am adding the header tags. Header. Body. I am closing the body tag. Now uh, inside this body tag, I am adding center tag. I am closing the center tag. H1. I am closing the header H1. How to create color picker menu into drop down select option. using angular js i am closing the header tab after that i am adding horizontal line now after the horizontal line i am adding the do container i am closing the do now between this do i am adding select option element i am closing the select tag i am adding the option tags I'm closing the option. Let's copy this one and paste here. Now the first option is a default label for the drop down control. Value is equals to empty. Selected hidden. The value of the option is select color. Is the default text of, of the drop down control. That's it. Up to now we have just finished the designing part. But before adding the AngularJS functionality to bind the colors into this select option element, let's save the file. I'm saving this file. Background drop down list AngularJS ang.htm. Let's check the basic output how it looks at designing part on the browser. And this is the output of that HTML code. Uh, right now, this HTML page contains only the header tags and the drop down control with the label select color. Now, my aim is using AngularJS, I want to bind the color picker menu into this drop down. So, first thing, let's add the latest AngularJS CDN link. Searching for AngularJS CDN. And from the search results, I'm selecting the angular.js. Now in this website, we can find different versions of the angular.js, angular, angular2. But I'm selecting the version 1.11. Come to the bottom. And this is a CDN link we require angular.min.js. Copy this one and add here in the address section. Script. I'm closing the script tag. Source is equals to. I'm pasting the CDN link of the angular.js. After that, I'm adding another script for the angular functionality. Variable app is equals to angular.module between double quotes I am adding the angular application name which I am adding in this do container do ng iphone app is equals to my app let's copy this application name angular js comma array now let's create the controller app.controller between double quotes 
I'm adding the controller director in the same deal ng hyphen controller is equals to my controller. Let's copy this one and add here comma function dollar scope Now in this function I'm adding some colors dollar scope dot colors is object is equals to semicolon between curly braces I'm adding the name colon the color name is red and the color property between single quotes I'm adding the red comma let's copy this one the next color name is yellow the color is yellow the next color name is a pink the color is pink the next color name is a cyan color is cyan and the last one I'm adding orange the color is orange I don't require this comma here just for the demo purpose I have added few colors into this angular function now let's bind these colors into this select option the second option value in this option I'm adding the direct to ng repeat is equal to I'm adding the object name color select in we are getting the colors from this colors object after that style is equals to background color colon I'm adding the angular expression color select dot I'm adding the color let's add the name of the color also between this angular expression color select dot the name that's it we have done the complete coding part let's save this file we'll check the final results on the browser right now this drop down control is empty I am reloading the browser see here we got the colors are binded into this drop down control using angular js that's it